This Sunday, November 3rd, at 2 a.m., it's time to roll back the clocks for the end of daylight saving time. That means an extra hour of sleep, but don't forget to reset your clocks before bed. However, this shift comes with a downside shorter daylight hours. For the next few months, expect darkness to set in by late afternoon, which can disrupt daily routines. While the autumn transition is typically easier, it can be tough for those affected by seasonal affective disorder or SAD. Studies show the spring change can disrupt our body rhythms, potentially leading to health risks. Many health organizations, including the American Medical Association, advocate for permanent standard time to better align with our natural circadian rhythms. In fact, a coalition led by the American Academy of Sleep Medicine is pushing for this change. Most countries don't observe daylight saving, and in the United States, only Arizona and Hawaii remain on standard time year-round. To ease the transition back to standard time, Gradually adjust your bedtime in the days leading up to the change. Increase your morning sunlight exposure to help reset your internal clock. Consider using a sleep mask to block light and improve sleep quality during darker evenings. Lastly, change your clocks the night before to avoid confusion and help your body adjust more smoothly. There's ongoing discussion about whether to end the time switch altogether, but for now, let's embrace that extra hour.